Let's see how we can use Visual Studio and GitHub together to create a simple Git workflow that's great for individuals, small teams, smaller open source projects, etc. The first thing I have to do is to connect Visual Studio to my GitHub account. I do that from account settings where I can click the add GitHub account button. This will take me to the browser where I can connect an existing GitHub account or create a new one. All I have to do now is to publish the project to GitHub. I go to the Git top level menu and click create Git repository. By default, Visual Studio will create a private repository on GitHub, so it's only me that can see that source code, not anyone else. And I simply click Create and Push. That creates a local Git repository and a remote one on GitHub, then links the two together and pushes all the local code to GitHub. And from this point on, I'm now connected and can continue my development. I'm going to modify this file just by updating a string. To see modifications throughout my files in my project, I go to the Git Changes window, which lists all modified files. And if I double click any one of them, it opens up in the diff view, which shows me exactly what has been modified. At the bottom of the screen in the status bar, I can see that I have exactly one change in this project. So I'm always aware what's going on. I'm now ready to commit my changes to Git source control. I'm going to type in a commit message explaining what I was doing and then click the commit all button. This saves the changes locally in my local Git repository. And in order to transfer that change onto GitHub, I click the push button. And that now synchronizes my local repository with GitHub. And if we look on the GitHub page for this repository, we can see that the changes I just made were successfully pushed out and I now have a full backup on GitHub. If I want to see the history of my repository, I can click the outgoing incoming link, which opens the Git repository window where I can see all branches and forks and manage my entire repo very, very easily. 